holding on to Bitcoin is a roller coaster ride. It's up 10% one month, down 20% the next. This makes it hard for retailers to accept it as payment. Now, they can try and hedge the volatility, but it cuts into their profits. This is a common stated reason why Bitcoin will fail as a currency. Now, it's only volatile as at the current moment. Like if you go back into gold, let's see, I wanna see how volatile gold was. Gold price lifetime. Because Bitcoin is still in its sort of price discovery phase where they don't know what the price is. But look at this, this is pretty like volatile. This is, it looks like a Bitcoin cycle. Okay, uh, gold price lasts 200 years. Let's see if that works. Adjusted for inflation. Look at this. This is pretty volatile, but this is a ratio. Okay, whoa, so gold would just be 500, dipped all the way down, went up, down, 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 up, down, down. So like, it's as volatile as freaking gold. Well, maybe it's more volatile and it's going up and down, but then it's the Bitcoin's going up and down on an upward trend. Whereas gold, look in the last 100 years, it's only went from like 500 to like 1,200. So like Bitcoin went from a dollar or like a few cent to freaking $160,000. So it's actually like, it's as volatile as gold. So you're saying gold is a scam and gold will fail. 